everyone, my name is Web Weaver, and welcome back to another episode of It's Look Who It Is. Can you believe that it is November now? Uh, November 2nd, you know, about to be November 3rd. But, uh, you know, we're on that November grind set. And... I don't know, I actually don't know who I've played recently. We're gonna, we're gonna look at the channel, look at the thumbnails. That's the, the point why they exist, is to help me easily be able to track what characters that we played and so that you can look at the thumbnail and see what characters being played so you can be like ooh a uh, a blank run delightful honestly apparently we haven't played an ico run in almost 14 days that is pretty funky we could um but you know there is someone who is more well-equipped to the gambling arc than anyone else. Um. I think it's time, chat. I think it is very much, very well, time to play Yumiko. And what we'll do is actually give me Seventh Curse. And then we're going to up the ante a little bit. Now what I want to do, very simply, is we buy a camera <laughs> and then we ball. We ball out of our goddamn minds and we hope for the best. I mean, we don't need the schoolyard. We're on seventh curse, so there's no reason to, you know... There ain't no reason for it. None of the people at the schoolyard can start- Unless we want to make, uh, high schoolers accidentally fall down, uh, elevator shafts, get struck by lightning, or get isekai'd, uh, into another world. Which, I mean, admittedly, this is the, uh, the eldritch Jun Junji Ito-esque verse of, like, everything is scary. Uh, so maybe getting isekai'd would probably put you in a better world. However... This is a world where you can quickly become powerful enough to kill God in the span of... I actually don't know how the time system works in this game, because I, I believe originally each mystery was supposed to be one day, but then it was like, you know, it can go from May to June, and then it just kind of stays that way, and it's something that you have to opt into by clicking that button up there. It's a little bit weird. I don't really know. I, I don't really know the time scale of this game. But if you lived in the world of horror universe, you'd be able to get incredibly strong very, very quickly. And you could just be walking down the street, take a portal to the Eldritch Dimension. And uh, it's like when those talking cats show up, and sometimes they're like, okay, you can have uh, one magic pill that gives you, like, certain effects, but then they have downsides. But this time, you woke up in a, in a Eldritch universe in the middle of a desert. And then a magical talking cat walked up to you and said that it wants to help you survive. Pick three items out of this list. And then there you go. I, listen, I don't like the AI voice things, but there's something about those videos that are just like so charming that it's like that is my personal kryptonite, uh, kryptonite of like, I normally do not subscribe, like, or do anything. Like, it, if I see something that's AI generated, I'm out, right? Like, I, I, I'm completely out. Uh, it's, I don't like it. I, I don't like the, the AI generations. I'll be honest with you. I would prefer if you need some sort of graphic to either use a placeholder or to make some shitty thing in MS Paint. Uh, because that's way more charming, and that, that's, you know, I think that's way better, at least in my opinion. But, um, painting, huh? I mean, we're gonna buy a camera, so I guess we'll see. Household hell, abnormal arms, noisy nails. I guess we'll just start household hell, yeah. But, uh, what was I gonna say? I don't recall. I was talking about AI stuff. But, uh... I guess the, the, those, like, talking cat walk, those, ta the talking cat walks up to you and then gives you, like, one of the seven magic pills or lets you press one of the seven magic buttons, uh, or, you know, 
the rich guy named Jeff or your local wizard. I don't know what it is, but there's, there's something so charming about those, like, would you rather choose your own adventure YouTube shorts. I like them. I I, I can't deny. I, I do like them. I think they're, they're quite cute. But, uh, you know, speaking of AI stuff, um, that horrific, like, nightmare AI Minecraft thing is insane, and I almost want to try it, but I don't know if I want to, like, burn down a tree to, like, play it, you know? Like, that... I... So here's the thing. Somebody made this, like, AI video game that is just Minecraft, right? But it's it, Minecraft being simulated and generated by the AI as you play it. And so some crazy shit can happen to the point where people are like, no matter what you do, no matter how far you go, no matter how much you dig, you will always end up at the village. You will always end up at the mountain. Because basically what happens is if it, like, if it sees like a wooden plank, it assumes that you're in like a, a village or something. And so it just generates a village. But if it sees like something fire, it could think that you're in the nether. And there's some insane stuff, like, somebody very... <laughs> this is a horrible name for it. Do I want to... Uh, you know what? EXP is important. We'll, we'll, we'll go here real quick. So, so, there, th this is a bad name, and I'm only going to say it once, because it is, like, kind of incredible. Uh, but somebody called it Dementia Minecraft. <laughs> and that's really bad. But also, like, it feels like that Bart Simpson walk, like that Bart Simpson walking into the wall video, where you just keep hitting yourself on the wall, and then like, you just get like teleported to another part of the house or another part of the room, and then you bash yourself against one wall, and it's like it's a nightmare, man. Like, I I've been watching clips of people playing it. Uh, the uh, the AI generated Minecraft and it's like oh my god you know you can be digging and then like every time you look down it like regenerates the world around you and it's so crazy like I don't mean to be like mean or rude or anything like that but that shit's so nuts that, that shit is so nuts dude we're gonna do a little bit of gambling for fun just because I, I think it would be entertaining, but, like... That shit's crazy, man. It is. Oh, my God. You know, speaking of gambling, sometimes you're gonna get hit. Sometimes you're gonna, you're gonna miss. But, hey, our knowledge is going up. That's fun. It's really surprising. Our knowledge and uh, luck are our best stats right now. Which, uh, considering that we start with minus one knowledge, and that is considering, like, we have minus one knowledge, it's still our highest stat. That's kind of crazy, actually. I, uh, I think that overwhelmingly we're feeling pretty, pretty good about this run so far. Very fast household hell, too. Can't complain about that at all. Arcane Storm. Now, of course, we fought one enemy, and they were a doom enemy, and an easy doom enemy at that, so we haven't really had to gamble. I mean, I don't really want Haunting Dreams. I really want Swift Maneuver because I want that alleged, like, 60% dodge chance. Maybe. Like, if we can get the camera, if the camera counts as a dodge action, like, as far as the game's code is considered, and we get to a 60% dodge chance, I think it's just, like, the, the most overpowered thing in the game, honestly. We, we can go here. We, we can go ahead and go here. We have the police station on the mansion, so we're, we're, we're being chillin'. We're, we're, just, we're just hanging out. But, um, so here's the thing. I, for the, the sleeper agents in the chat know what games that I'm playing right now. Uh, and I had an amazing, uh, boss fight. I was doing the, uh, C3 boss. Uh, I'm, I'm gonna still be a little bit vague. And I had, like, I got this dumbass relic thing that made it to where whenever I used uh, Dark Blue, I lost sanity. And we're being purposely vague here. Uh, be, we're not using the correct terminology on purpose, chat. But, um... Uh, we can probably just reveal ourselves, that's fine. 
I, I don't normally do that, but I think it's completely okay. Uh, we're full health right now, and we're gonna be dodging, so theoretically, hopefully. We rolled an 11 out of 8. You hate to see it, but, um... And I got, like, really low sanity, so my units all died at the very beginning. Well, they didn't die, but, like, they got really low health at the very beginning, and it was, like, completely washed. Like, she was, like, 80 or 90% health on form, like, phase one, uh, and it was just so wrong. Uh, but I locked in, I took some gambles, and I managed to clear it on my first try, and it was absolutely insane. I almost threw at the end there, because I didn't know the difference between, uh, uh, what is it, like, body parts and health bars, and, like, you can, if you outspeed the body part that's attacking, you can attack the broken body part to just do direct damage that's unopposed to the health bar. I won the clash pretty easily because it was uh, an ego, as it were. But, like, I haven't started the first two games yet. And I was thinking, like, I don't know if I want to uh, record because game one, I've heard, is, like, it's entirely possible that you don't like game one. Like, game one is, like, very... Game, game one is janky as hell, it's super difficult, it genuinely is, like, really hard, and it's also just, like, clunky, and you might not like it, you know what I mean? So it's entirely possible that you get into it and you're like, yeah, this is uh, abysmal dog shit, but I like the lore, so I'm just gonna look it up on YouTube or watch, like, a playthrough. Uh, we're not gonna make the same mistake again, I am not gambling uh, with that. I, I guess, um... Yeah, man-eating plant. Uh, interestingly enough, is the second enemy. So keep that in your back pocket for later. But, uh, like, the first game is janky as hell, and I've heard that from, like, friends who play it, that, like, yeah, it, it's entirely legitimate that you just not like the game. Uh, the funny mask is so good, but we, we're on the gambling arc. I can't, I can't, I can't. The funny mask is, like, top-tier items, but the... Like, uh, Funny Mask is, like, probably the best B-slot item in the game, if I had to just kind of spitball off the top of my head. The healing is just so strong. But, uh, so I don't know if I want to record the first game, because, like, I'm basically in it for, like, the the lore and the story, and I want to pay attention. Like, that that's the problem, right? Is, like, I want to pay attention to what's going on, because, A, the games are really complicated, but, B... Because when you're in, um, when you're in a YouTube streamer, let's player gamer mode, you're paying less attention to the game, and so that would mean that I'm gonna make a lot of dumb mistakes. And for something like Noja, that's funny and fine because it's like a social deduction thing. So it's like, haha, let's player made dumb mistake and died for it. You know, that's perfectly fine. Uh, do I want to do flood? No, not at all, right? Absolutely not. No, there's no way we do flood here, right? There's no way we do flood here, right? Why do I want to do Flood here? Am I crazy? Why Why did I click Flood? This is so bad. Like, this is, like, genuinely the wrong play, but I just want to do this because it'd be funny? Because it, cause it'd be entertaining? Because it would be, like, a goof, a gaff, and or a laugh, maybe? And I'm... I, this is also the wrong play. I just want to use the flashlight, or the, the camera. I want to use the flash camera action. I don't know why. Joy and whimsy? In my video game? Get it out of here. What the hell? Oh my god. If this turns out well, this should not turn out well. But, uh... So, but the thing is, like, I'm trying to fo Like... The games require a lot of your brain power. And they are also just kind of, like... In some aspects, frustrating. The second game is just good. Like, I've heard the second game is just a banger. Um... I honestly, I feel like but I, I don't know if I have the time to do this with multiple games, is to do the thing that I'm doing with Noja, where I have, like, a offline playthrough, and then that is just, like... Oh, do I want to do this? Do I want to get... I kind of want to get plus two damage. Because if we get a Theologist, it's like... Here's the thing. The Theologist is making our failed bets uh, slightly less bad, but the... Uh... The plus one damage is making it to where we have to bet less because we're just doing more damage. I, I don't know why I'm doing this. This is crazy. I'm not even full sanity. What am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? I'm throwing. 
Just believe in the gambling arc? Holy shit, believe in the gambling arc. The, the, these are stonks. The Father Yasugi stonks. Like, what the hell is happening? I don't know what's happening. We have a Thutu Flame. I'm thinking about casting a Thutu Flame. So I think the ideal world would be, um... You know, the, the ideal world. I, honestly, if that was doing three instead of four, that would be so much better, but... The ideal world, in my opinion, would be, um... If I was able to... Whatchamacallit. Yeah, that, that, that flash... Uh, the, the camera flash is gonna need to work. Uh, pretty soon. And by pretty soon, I mean, um... Now? Yeah, it's gonna need to work now. It didn't work now, chat. It did not work now, chat, at all. Well, we have to do this again. That's, uh... Irregardless of the situation, we have to do this again. Um... Can we, we can prep the next attack. So that's pretty good. I like that. Uh, we're going to forget Ithutu Flame, which is uh, not what I wanted to do, but it is what we did. Thank you. Thank you. Now, I would have loved to cast Ithutu Flame, but we, 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 can't, uh, we can't guarantee that. I want to keep the flashlight because it does save us some like trouble in the future. But you know what? We got to make up for lost time here. Now, this is a lot of damage, chat. This is a lot of damage. Why did I think forgetting the spell would do anything? We're, we're going to four. Okay, so here's the thing. Uh, I need to regain uh, one reason so that we go to five. And then I need to hit a 85% chance. Sounds good to me. Sounds good to me. Didn't sound good to the game, though. It didn't sound good to the game, though. So we're, like, pretty close to winning. Uh, if, you can if you can believe it, we're actually, like, kind of close to winning. Now, we could... I... I mean... I... I, we, we could, we could. I, I don't, is this legal? I, I feel like something is going to go wrong. Did I do it wrong? I've, I've never even, I've never even thought about that before. What, what, huh? You're, you're allowed to do that? Uh, I, I'm, I mean... Yeah, I I guess you are. I don't really think swinging a hit is going to do anything because why would we ever prep an attack ever? Maybe it'll come up like once, like we prepped an attack this time like in this fight, but like I What did I do? I'm going to take outdoorsman because I'm scared. And I I I'm scared of this game. I don't even know if we have to go to the forest again. Maybe I should take art knowledge, but I don't know if we have to go to the school. What is... No, I'm sorry. My, my, my brain is just vacant. Like, it's just, it's just Jover. It's just, I... I think I did a play so insane and batshit crazy that I actually just... I... I, I you know what? We have, like... This, this gets us up to nine luck. We're gonna take it anyways. I don't care. But I... I don't think I can... I, I don't know if I can play the game anymore. Like, I it's just... Something happened. I, I just did, like, the most unhinged play I think I've ever done in this game, where I sacrificed eight stamina. Just, I had full, I had full stamina, so uh, why not, right? What was I? <laughs> what the hell? I mean, we need to get lucky here, because I, I don't want to, I don't want to do anything. I, I, I. I, okay, please don't make me use my brain from for the rest of this video. I, my brain is still processing what the hell happened here. That's crazy. I don't even remember what I was. I, I, 
I guess I'll just repeat myself because like I don't I don't know if like I, I guess we take sanity here unfortunately but like oh, we we just rest we have the doom we have the doom we can just rest like twice that's fine um but like what what I was saying earlier I which I I don't even I don't even remember if I finished my my sentence or not but like I I don't know if I have enough time or mental energy to do like another offline playthrough that has to go ahead of the YouTube playthrough. Uh, just so that I can get the full, um, the, the full experience. Um, even though, like, I, I am definitely gonna figure out how to re-enable NVIDIA Shadowplay so that if I pull off some crazy shit in, uh, the Gacha game again, because I've done some pretty crazy shit in that game. Uh, and by the way, for the, the boss that I mentioned earlier, my team was five levels underleveled, and I was using a lot of base identities, and they were all pretty bad. I had, like... I did have Cloud Cutter. I'm sorry. I'm just... I'm out of it. I'm completely out of it. What You, you expect me to play the game after four meditations in a row? Like, what the hell is wrong <laughs> with me? I... I, I, I feel like I've done a combination of moves in a video game that was, like, perfectly valid, the correct thing to do, we've recovered almost perfectly with no issues, uh, and no long-term consequences, and I, I, I feel like I've inflicted a headache on myself, right? Like, I, I feel like I've done something that is just genuinely, like, not okay. Like, I... <laughs> I mean, it's the gambling arc chat, so we gamble, right? It's the gambling arc, so we gamble. You're goddamn right we do. But, like, I... I literally just... I I feel... I, I gave myself a headache. I'm just completely, like, BTFO'd. Completely. I, I don't know how to process the information that's happening on my screen anymore. Thank you, Luck, for, uh... I don't know. Are we just gonna go in here? Are we just gonna go into this boss arena? We're on Mystery 4? What the hell? I should have rested again! We're on Mystery 4! 48% Doom! What the hell is happening? <laughs> <laughs> it's a stamina boss. I hope it isn't a boss, but it is a stamina boss if he's there. Thank God for that. I don't know. Um, swift maneuver? Hell yeah! Absolute cinema. Absolute cinema, chat. I... <laughs> I don't know what the hell... I, I... I just... Four meditations in a row. Boost, boost, attack. That was what I did, and that was correct. That was, like, the, the the correct, most guaranteed way to win that fight. Like, with the least RNG, that was the least gambling arc thing I could have done, but I, I was mesmerized. I was completely... I... I... It was genius. It was an incredible move. It was an incredible gambit. It, it was a, a, a brilliant... It was a brilliant play. Uh, slams finger in car door. Slam's hand in car door. Masterful gambit. I just... I can't believe it. I, I genuinely can't believe it. Four meditations. Four meditations. And that was correct. <laughs> Why minus stamina? I, I'm just gonna rest, chat. We could even get the goddamn prep item to make this fight easier. <laughs> But I want to go gambling, and we have a sewing kit, right? So we've got to do it. We've got to do it. What the hell is happening? Like, we, we can just fully heal? <laughs> I just... I mean, you gotta go gam... Wait, listen, somebody's doing four damage to you, you gotta go gambling. Why is our attack chance so good? That's amazing. We're, we have a 107% chance to hit. Like, I don't even know what to say. Like, this is bad. Like, yeah, it's pretty bad. Like, I mean, I like, blocking is correct here because then we kill next turn. We take two damage. It doesn't even matter. Well, actually, it does kind of matter because we should do this instead so that if Mangled Hand procs, you know, we don't die. Um, I, I just, wow. Wow, 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 wow. I, I just, what, what do you, what, what do you want me to say? And, like, listen, you're like, okay, uh, you did a bad combat action against an enemy doing minus four to all. What are you going to do now? I'm going to rest. I'm going to rest to full health, and it won't matter. We have one hospital investigation to do, and 
even if I forget both of the seconds, unless this is branded like cattle, which it's not, by the way, luck check success. Like, I, I don't... <laughs> Why is my shit so good? I really would have liked to, uh, at some point, get one point of strength so that I could do two basic attacks, but, uh, you, you know, that would increase our damage by, like, three or something, but I don't know. Bro, I've got a sewing kit and painkillers. Every gamble that fails, we just heal. Like, what? <laughs> what is happening, dude? What is happening? Like, here's the thing, right? What's even crazier about this is that we, we can just handcuff you. We, we can just handcuff you. I... Oh, he's just doing bonus. I, I wasn't even paying attention. Look at this shit! We could get both of them... <laughs> we could get every lighthouse thing wrong and we would live. We don't have Innsmouth look either. We we could literally get... E <laughs> we could get every single lighthouse thing wrong. Every single lighthouse thing wrong. We could get every single lighthouse thing wrong. And we would live. Every single one. It doesn't matter. It, it literally doesn't matter. We Every single thing wrong. None, not, the lighthouse does not matter. We even have handcuffs to see if that, like, if that dickhead is around, we can just handcuff him. <laughs> what is happening? The eight knowledge, nine luck build? I don't even know how much luck we have, by the way. This we, we can even get, I don't know, like, I, we, we can just do this, and then we, we can, uh, we can do this, and then handcuff him. And we, <laughs> We're level four. <laughs> we're level four. We're le we're level four. That that being level five did nothing for us, because because we got it literally on the last investigation, which was a guaranteed minus three because we didn't have eight strength. Like what the hell happened? What is what what happened, chat? What happened? I don't know. This run was so weird. <laughs> It just like it was just like going, it was going, it was a fine run, normal run, gambling arc run, fun run, and then just all of a sudden it's like, what the hell happened? I just I sometimes this game completely sometimes this game still gets me. Sometimes this game still gets me. And I'm just left completely baffled. Thanks for watching. Stay safe out there. Have a good one. Bye.